obviously very disappointed in the loss. Um, didn't think we played very well at all on either side of the ball, and uh, certainly not well enough to win. Um, penalties, turnovers, and uh, big plays, missed tackles killed us, uh, as well as not being able to protect on field goal protection. And um, is a uh, uh, you know credit to Kent State. Their kids played hard. They they played well enough to beat us. Um, we didn't play very well, and uh, that responsibility falls on my shoulders. I I will accept responsibility for the loss. I didn't have our guys ready to play, obviously, because we didn't play <coughs> well enough or consistent enough throughout four quarters of the game to to beat a team at home. So. With that, I'll take questions. Is there, a, <coughs> is there a discussion about going for it on fourth and one for your quarter? There, there was some, but you know, in a fourth quarter of a game, uh, where I felt like our defense was playing reasonably well, um, I thought uh, you know, to give them the ball at midfield when all they needed is a field goal with with that much time left was was uh, you know probably the you know. The lesser of two evils was to punt it, which you know they started that drive on the 13-yard line. So you know, it was my expectation that we'd either get the ball back one more time uh, at midfield with two timeouts left and a chance to move down and score, or uh, you know we would, you know, the clock would expire and expect them to drive down and, and kick a game-winning field goal. You know, I'm gonna have to look at it. I mean, some of it were, you know, we had a couple off of tips, and you know, put the ball on the ground. Corey's fumbled it. You know, it, it just, uh, it was just sloppy play. You know, I mean, you have to do a better job taking care of the football, and and uh, you know, um, I think at least two of them came off a of tip. I mean, we we dropped at least three balls too that we had guys open. I mean, so again, it was just, uh, you know. Um, I don't. Uh, I don't question the effort as much as I just question that. You know, the execution and execution's a, a function of concentration, and um, you know, and sustained concentration. And so, when you don't have it, and when you you don't have that razor's edge, I mean, that's when you give up big plays. It's when you, you know, um, that's when you drop balls. That's when, you know, you put the ball on the ground. And so. Um, you know, I thought for the most part, I thought our defense played uh, well enough, except for the, you know, late in the fourth quarter. You know, we gave up the long run. I mean, that's unacceptable. But, you know, uh, it's a game where you have to be consistent, you know, throughout four quarters. And, and so, you know, bottom line is we allowed them to score more points than we scored. So, you know, we lose. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm – uh, I'm confident that we'll we'll bounce back, um, but uh, right now I'm I'm pretty upset. I mean, I, I, and that's part of it may be a factor, but I mean it's a football game. You're playing to win. And you're a competitor. You're going to go out and compete to win games. And so, uh, you know, their team's out of it. They've only won two games. You know, that didn't stop them from coming in here and competing and hard and, and you know and trying to take a win you know and they took a win away from us you know and, and again hats off to them they you know they made the plays when they counted talk about uh, preparation that kind of thing is preparing for a running quarterback one of the most difficult things to do i think it definitely presents challenges but you know we knew that it's not like we didn't they didn't show us anything different i mean they, you know they're they stayed true to their script in terms of what they've done. And again, for the most part, we were pretty good at stopping them, but we let them out a couple times, you know, and that's all it, only, that's all it takes, unfortunately. And if you, you know, no, no defense is good enough, no alignment, no blitz is good enough to overcome a missed tackle. You know, when you have a player in position to make a tackle and they don't make the tackle, you know, <laughs> doesn't matter what you draw up, you know, so just like no offense is good enough to overcome not finishing blocks. So, uh, you know, again, it's, it's, it's very, very frustrating. Um, and, you know, I'm, you know, I accept, I'm the head coach. I accept responsibility for it. Where's the confidence level? I, can't, I don't know if I can answer that. Um, 
Yeah, I don't know if I can answer that. I don't know where it is. I, I thought, you know, going into this game, I thought it was still pretty good. But hopefully, um, what I challenge them to do, and our coaches and myself, is to, to really have some inner reflection and not to look and point fingers, but to look in the mirror and try to figure out where, you know, each, each man can get better, what he needs to do better. And again, I don't, I really don't believe that it's a, a function of effort. You know, at this point, I think that, uh, I think we played hard, but, you know, there's a difference between playing hard and playing well, you know, and playing hard and playing smart. And, you know, I know I've shared this with them and I'll, I'll share it with you guys, but, you, you know, to win and win consistently, you have to first learn how not to lose. Uh, and when you turn the ball over and when you have penalties and when you allow big plays in the kicking game and when you allow big plays on offense, on defense and when you get the quarterback hit and sacked, uh, <laughs> that's, that's how you lose. And so you have to, you know, you have to figure out uh, what's important to you and, uh, you know, really <coughs> <coughs> learn how to not do those things first. I don't think so. I don't. Really, I, I really don't believe so. I mean, um, it's a fair question. It's a good question. I, I don't believe so based on, from my perspective and the interaction that I see with them or, and have with them. But, uh, <coughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think so, no. Uh, 